so a week ago, Smelly announced sandbox mode in Tower Heroes Discord group. This mode is still on testing and haven't complete yet, and the people were excited over it. But the people who have access to this is the contributors, but that's not why we're here. We're here for the people who want the sandbox mode to be early, and I just want to tell them. Please be patient. Yeah, and more. Sandbox mode is a bunch of fun to mess around, but please be patient though. By the way, I'm not saying that people who ask sandbox mode is dumb, but look, I don't want to give them any sort of hate to them. We keep in mind that Tower Heroes only work with three people, Smelly, Hyola, and Radical, which means that the update might take months due to how many people work at the game. We should be patient about it, cause these people work hard on Tower Heroes. So what we just need to do is respect the wait and don't harass the devs with the release sandbox mode early. Plus with the reason why it's only for contributors plus, cause there might be some bug or glitches that can broke sandbox mode, which made the sandbox even fun with the exception of it's currently on testing and haven't been 100% completed so they tested the sandbox mode with the contributors plus so they can see the result of it and fixing some bugs that one of the contributors found but i still have more with the sandbox mode being added to the game you can still play the sandbox mode if a contributors join a tower hero server that you were in and choosing the mode sandbox i actually never tried the sandbox before with one of the contributors but there's the footage of it on youtube if you want to check it out i can leave some other video that i can find but i really wondered how it feels in sandbox mode i'm not saying that i wanted to get the sandbox mode early i just want to imagine how the sandbox mode feels like when it's 100 percent complete by the way let me know what do you think about sandbox mode but i'm not sure how to end the video now because i never thought my opinion would be that short though with the shortness of the video i really hope you enjoy the video i'll try to make the video a little bit longer because commentary like this isn't too much of my thing and i'm still learning about commentary so yeah since the video is kind of short i'll try to make it longer by what will i do when the sandbox mode came and with the feature i want when the sandbox mode release i'm gonna mess around with it obviously with the other side of practicing fences and use mechanic and i might make fences tutorial and with the use of invincible tower build but since sandbox mode can spawn you any enemies i really wonder if you can spawn mimic let's just hope that the mimic can't give you coins to make it fair what feature i want to come with sandbox mode is an option to delete enemies it's like when you accidentally spawn too many enemies and it lags the server but all of the enemies are slow enemies you might either wait for the enemies to get into the end of the map or leave but the option to delete enemies seems more effective rather than waiting or leave the server so that's it the feature i wanted in sandbox mode by the way let me know what feature you want to come in sandbox mode now what i just want to say is thank you for watching the video and i'll see you guys in the next video bye bye